A student accidentally touches a sharp object. Her hand is immediately pulled away from the object. The diagram shows the structures involved in this response. Okay, so we've got a sharp object there, we've got a receptor, cell, we've got a sensory neuron come over here to the spinal cord, motor neuron then back down here to the muscle. Describe how the structures labelled on the diagram are involved in this reflex action. Okay, so the whole point here, describe what describe what happens during a reflex action. It's one, two, three, four. So first thing is, we're gonna start here. We've got these are the structures labelled. One, two, three, four. Perfect. So I'm gonna put them in that order. So receptor. detects the, the stimulus or the sharp object okay so if you've remembered the the sort of generic thing for this the stimulus in this case is the sharp object the next thing is the information passes oh, we've got central neuron so an impulse or the information or the message, uh, but impulse travels along the sensory neuron to spinal cord. Okay, it then travels from the spinal cord. So information or impulse. Impulse travels from spinal cord to motor neuron. Oh, sorry, a long motor neuron. A long motor neuron neuron to muscle cells to the muscle okay and the last thing that happens is the muscle so what's going to happen here that's the bicep muscle if the hand moves that way the muscle contracts and hand is lifted away Okay, so they're the four things that happens that happen. And that's how a reflex action takes place.